YouTube, Dubstep Slap 415, back with a ton of new pickups today. Let's go ahead and get straight to it. I hope you enjoyed that little footage from the Dunk Exchange. While I was there, I picked up four tees and one pair. Shout out to Fully Laced for giving everyone one of the little goodie bags. This one came with uh, some 54 inch Nike SB laces, Fully Laced pen, as well as a Fully Laced sticker. Got a couple stickers from the companies that I bought while there. I'm gonna get into uh, the tees after. Got a lanyard right here. Civilian-clothing.com. Sick company. It's one of their tees. I'll get into it more soon. We got a The City New Era Snapback. Hopefully you guys can tell. This uh, top rim is a nice smooth leather. Orange underbrim. White snap. The city patch right there. Stoked I was able to find this real cheap while looking for the uh, giveaway prizes. Got an Orlando Magic snapback from 4ucaps.com. New Era 950. Gray under. Orlando Magic on the back in uh, red and navy. Red snap. Perfect match for any Olympic shoe. Finally, Montreal Expos. This is a uh, LeBron 9 Easter colorway. Definitely a new green on the brim. You see your hits of mint mixed with new green, white, and charcoal. Montreal Expos on the back. These next couple pickups, got to give a shout out to Pearl at PickYourShoes.com. Right now, PickYourShoes.com is uh, doing a uh, little promotion. If you order one of these Han Cholo pendants, they're going to throw in a Pick Your Shoes prize pack. Thanks again to Pearl for this prize pack. We've got the uh, PYS Goodwood bracelet. The Pick Your Shoes carabiner. Pick Your Shoes Keychain, Dope PYS Snapback, and finally a Glow in the Dark Trexy, little uh, PYS Trexy doll. But let's get into the Han Cholo piece. Little black box, Han Cholo on the top. Bam. Super sick. This is the uh, Han Cholo Ghetto Blaster piece. The Ghetto Blaster boombox. Crazy nice. Very nice gold chain. Very dope piece. I believe they have a few left at PickYourShoes.com. So head over there and pick one up. They will not last. Getting right into the tees I got at the Dunk Exchange. First up, we got an all red civilian tee with a little civilian graphic in gold. Perfect match for the Diamond Turf 2s. Next up, another civilian tee. Civilian clothing. Don't make moves, make movements. Las Vegas. Thought this was a very dope tee. Shout out to uh, Civilian for coming up to the Dunk Exchange from Las Vegas. This next shirt is from finallyhip.com, but I did cop this at the Dunk Exchange. The link will be down in the description. This is the best three shirt. We've got Michael Jordan, Scottie Pippen, and Dennis Rodman. It's looking faded out right here, but it's a crazy lime green for uh, Rodman's hair. Thought that was super creative. Definitely a must-cop for me. I believe they have a couple sizes left on their site. 
So I definitely recommend heading over there and checking them out. On the sleeve, you see finally hit. Last but not least, big shout out to my homie Rob, aka the CEO of Mac Life. Got the Mac Life Camo Forever tee. Real dope tee. Got forever in the bottom. Mac Life crown mixed in with the camo. Very nice. Keep an eye out for the upcoming Mac Life line. Got a very dope uh, jacket coming out. Be showing that sometime soon. Before I get into the shoes, I want to give a big shout out to Tao Tao 14. She did some sneaker drawings for me, and I just wanted to show them off. They're very sick, and I really appreciate them. First up, with the Nike SB Skunks. See, it says Mr. Snappy. Very dope. Thank you for this drawing. Next up. Nike SB Tiffany's, Diamond Supply Company, Dubstep Slap 415, very creative. And finally, she did her own version of the LeBron Free Gums design, which was uh, very dope. Definitely couldn't do this myself, so props to her. Again, thank you for the three drawings. I really appreciate it. Three more pickups before we get into the pairs. Got three backpacks from SprayGround.com. Got the Glow in the Dark Skeleton Backpack. Everything green you see on the backpack glows in the dark. Very creative design. Spray gown right there. Second bag is from the Money Collection. This is the Money Stacks Backpack. I would have liked to have gotten the uh, Money Stacks duffel, but that was sold out. Very cool. Stacks of cash all over the uh, entire bag. Hopefully, I'll be able to track down that duffel at one point. So right here, definitely my favorite out of the three. We got the fine gold backpack. 999.9 .9 net weight 1000 grams see the fine gold tag this is perfect to rock with the uh, <clears throat> Air Jordan Golden Moments pack you get the whole backpack covered in uh, I guess it would be like a patent gold leather maybe a pleather but it kinda feels like leather real nice gives it a good shine Head over to Sprayground if you're interested. The first three pairs today, three pairs of Nike SBs. Shout out to Smoke and Swag for this top pickup right here. Sent me a message on YouTube and uh, told me he had these for sale. The Nike SB P Rod 2.5. I saw these a while ago when they came out, and uh, for the price I got them, they were definitely worth it. The P Rod 2.5 in the uh, California colorway your green midsole with your red stripe all white tumbled leather upper and a nice uh, brown nubuck on the mid panel Nike SB on the back he did wear these twice but uh, you really can't tell so shout out to you homie I appreciate you looking out on the right got a gold box Nike Dunk Low Premium SB, gold and Atlantic blue. You guys see right there, it said Newcastle. These are the Nike SB Newcastles. Definitely uh, a creative release, in my opinion. Very nice materials used on this. And Newcastle is a good beer. Nike SB tag, Nike SB in red. Comes with white laces your brown bottom very clean release glad I was able to find these for a very good price dead stock keep it moving <clears throat> gotta give a shout out to my homie Zaya X he copped this a while ago on his channel and once I saw it 
I pretty much set myself on a mission and I finally copped them. Nike SB Blue Box, Nike Dunk High Pro SB Sport Red and Black. Just gonna move these. These are the Nike SB Red Devil Highs, the extra red laces. You guys know the first pair of Red Devils I had. I uh, customized them into the Nike SB Magmas. I'll show you guys a pic of those right now. But I wanted to get the Red Devils. It's a very clean colorway by itself. All red suede. The black swoosh and the black laces. Definitely a dope shoe in my opinion. This next pickup right here is the one pair I got at the Dunk Exchange. Orange Nike box. Nike Zoom KD4, Tour Yellow, Lemon Twist, and Photo Blue. Shout out to the guys over at SoulLegit.com for hooking me up with this pair. I had to be patient on it. There was a guy in front of me possibly uh, working a deal for some Yeezys and I believe these. But uh, he let me kind of uh, swoop in and grab the scoring titles. Decided to go with the Yeezys later that day. Icy blue bottom, got the designs from the top of the shoe coming through on the bottom. Now you got your 28 KD 35, your 30.1, and your 27.7. Stoked to have a third pair. These are uh, one of my favorite KD 4s. Next two pairs, you guessed it, fire red 4s. On the right, got a pair for the future little man, Air Jordan 4 Retro GS, white, varsity red, and black. And then the adult box, size 13, Air Jordan 4 Retro, white, varsity red, and black. These boxes are a little difficult to get off with one hand. Alright. Here we go, the Fire Red 4s. Again, very pleased with the quality on these, <clears throat> especially on the little ones. Got the little one, size 4Y right there, matched up to my size 13. It'd be sick if they gave uh, the GS pairs mini hang tags. I thought that would be cool. Alright, so you got your uh, all white smooth leather upper your hits of red and black black back tab with your red jump man Jordan 4 bottom there's plenty of reviews on these just showing you guys I got me and the future little man a pair everyone who says congratulations on the kid thank you but again I don't have a kid on the way I'm just prepping for the future so I don't have to drop cash when I actually do have a kid on the way alright I gotta put out a warning before I show you this next pair I did not buy this my girlfriend bought it for me uh, she thinks it's hilarious cuz she loved the face when I first saw them not knowing what they were uh, she and I are real honest with each other and I went ahead and told her that this was probably the ugliest gift I've ever gotten so let's get right to it you see the adidas Jeremy Scott box JS bear size 13 so we have the Jeremy Scott I guess flower power or hippie bear you got flowers all over the damn shoe the Jeremy Scott bear Which are yellow bottoms, Adidas, Jeremy Scott signature on the other side. So yeah, I know a lot of people are going to comment about these, but remember the disclaimer, I did not buy these for myself. I personally think they're ugly, but it's a gift. I'm not going to throw away a gift. So just like the Leopards, they're just going to my collection. Two more Jordan boxes. These two came out about a week ago. Gotta give a big shout out to my sister 
she surprised me with these sent me the Nike confirmation email after she had ordered them I really didn't plan on copping these let's get straight to it on the right Air Jordan 7 Retro J2K Filbert Natural Obsidian and White on the left Air Jordan 7 Retro J2K Obsidian Natural Filbert and White So we've got the obsidian and khaki, in my opinion, Jordan 7 J2Ks right here. And I gotta say, they're better in person. Yeah, they're not the most attractive shoes. I probably could have done without this triangle pattern. The obsidian blue would have just been a uh, clean colorway. But hey. They're better than the picks let on. Definitely liking the blue over the uh, filbert, but the filbert is nice nonetheless. Navy blue laces. Is it just me or does that look like a coat hanger? Sorry. All right. Filbert upper. You got your obsidian contrast stitching. White jump man there. I believe. Yeah, white jump man on the obsidians with your white laces. Not much to say. Just let you guys look at them. What's your opinion on them? If they were given to you as a gift, would you keep them or would you flip them? We're getting through these pretty quick. Keep it going. Two pairs of LeBron 9 Lows. The one on the right is from Nike Store. The one on the left is from a friend in Southern California. Let's go ahead and get right to it. LeBron 9 Low, Wolf Gray, White, Dynamic Blue, and Fireberry. Wolf Gray, White, Dynamic Blue, and Fireberry. Went ahead and took the Fireberries out of the box. So here we go. All Silver Upper with hits of dynamic blue and fireberry your inside swoosh as well as your outside swoosh is white outlined in fireberry fireberry inner lining your laces wolf gray with dynamic blue dots and a fireberry LJ crown logo your 360 airbag all dynamic blue on the back at the World Basketball Festival patch that came on the LeBron 9 Low Entourage as well as a few of the Kobe's. White signature on the tongue. Inner lining. White and dynamic blue LJ crown on a Fireberry insole. Bottoms. Dynamic blue and Fireberry. LJ in white with a dynamic blue crown. Just a few more pickups left. Nike brown box. This was ordered uh, same time as the fours. Nike Zoom rookie, game royal, and game royal. Suggested retail is 200. So these are the Memphis blue Nike Zoom rookies your half cent logo on the tongue as well as under the translucent sole couple black traction pods your carbon fiber all game royal upper was really uh, on the fence about these until uh, I saw them in person and said why not don't match up with the uh, Royal Foams. Let's see. On the inner lining, got the rookie. I believe the other shoe has the number one. Correct me if I'm wrong. I really don't know what I'm more excited for the pair in front or the two behind. Let's get right into the front. LeBron 8 V1 box. LeBron 8 Retro Black. 
pink flash and filament green original retail 160 so what we got here LeBron 8 V1 South Beach these actually have been worn once for about three hours to uh, one of the heat finals games so shout out to dude who rocked him to the game fly wire on the back heel looking very sick honestly these could pass as dead stock got your little textures going up the eyelets on the back pink LeBron signature with the pink swoosh got your LeBron tongue lion with the pink eyes and then uh, the pink piping around the top <clears throat> very stoked to have another pair like the others, probably going to throw the pink laces in them. So again, shout out to the dude who sold his beaches for a ridiculously fair price and kept them super crispy. Remember, today my t-shirt releases at 3 p.m. Pacific Standard Time, 6 p.m. Eastern Standard Time on originalroughneck.bigcartel.com for $20 plus shipping last two pairs and I know a lot of people have been waiting to see this we have the yet to be released Jordan Golden Moments pack the six and seven starting off the top of the pack got a gold jump man on the side got Jordan six seven the jump man and then 92 show you the front Air Jordan Golden Moments Pack, multicolor, multicolor, screen, screen, 535-357-935. I don't know if that's for the 6 or the 7. I do believe they have different style codes. So we have the Golden Moments Pack open right now. Let's get into the 6s. First, you've got a uh, USA shoe bag gold jump man in the corner We've got a uh, little lace lock pull string up at the top some gold laces getting into the shoes here we go With the Air Jordan 6 golden moments pack icy blue bottom your red jump man gold jump man on the back air and red the quality on these is actually pretty nice it's pretty similar to the uh, Olympic sixes so if you're like me and you don't have uh, too high expectations for Jordan brand you should be pleased with uh, this pack got Jordan on the tongue in gold air and red white lace lock with a gold jump man these uh, gold laces are super short and I think they're just for decoration because they do come with uh, an extra pair of I'm assuming normal length white laces so when you're gonna get ready to rock them either buy some alternate gold or throw the white in but nonetheless the sixes were done very well but personally I gotta give it to the sevens over the sixes so let's get into those similar USA drawstring bag your gold jump man and then your little uh, pull string getting right into the sevens what we have the Golden Moments Air Jordan 7, black, white, and gold. Kind of like an off white between the gold and black right there. Very good color blocking on this shoe. <clears throat> Very nice combination of materials. 
smooth leather and nubuck. I wasn't sure how the quality was going to be, but uh, I'm pretty pleased with it. Got the gold triangle, the black 7, and the white 23. Your tongue is an all black tongue with Jordan and Air in gold. They didn't put the little uh, cardboard thing in the ankle, so the tongue did kind of uh, change shape, but I'm really not worried about that. Very stoked to have gotten these when I did. Shout out to the person who helped me. You know who you are. Get down.